Greetings and welcome back to Factorio. I'm Catherine of Sky and welcome to episode number 100 of my Yuoki mod experiment series. So I am driving an adorable little train and actually I should put it on automatic mode so we can go to the train parking area and uh, see if there's any other trains we can find here. One of the absolute gems of Yuoki's mod is all of the custom artwork he has done for the mod. Uh, and, oh, it appears some of my cars are too long. <laughs> oh my goodness. I should have made these parking spaces slightly bigger. But as you can see, we have a huge, huge, huge range of locos and, um, and, and, and cars available. I have done here. Let's see if we can go there. Okay, perfect. So I have put down one of each locomotive, um, middle car like this counts as it's built in a locomotive factory so it's kind of like a, a middle car i i don't know if yoki intended these engines like these to be you know one on each side of this like sometimes they are but they are absolutely beautiful uh, all the sprites made for these are just gorgeous there are a wide wide variety of colors and shapes and sizes and they're all very interesting uh looking different different types I've, I've kind of put them in order of we have like steam locomotives down here um, and then we've got the diesel and then the funky one at the end but I've also put down only one of each type of car so as you can see there are a huge huge number of different cars here um, and they all have like different amounts of stuff that you can put in them like some of them have one row some have three rows it's kind of funky um i'm not sure what prompted that but um they they do look very cool i don't know maybe it could be that um yoki has a very a fondness for long trains and that could very well be but there's all kinds of really interesting little details you know these are the green and blue stuff carriages um and so you could def definitely use these to make your trains a lot more um visible on the map you know, when you're looking around, oh yes, that's my my train bringing in the green stuff or the blue stuff and that kind of thing. So I think it's really, really cool. We've got tanker cars. We've got these really funky cars. Wow, two spaces in that car. That is very odd indeed. Um, but yeah, there's there's all kinds of different stuff um, here and it's really, really nice. I absolutely love this mod pack because of the beautiful, beautiful sprites that Yuoki has made, um, as well as the functionality of cool stuff. So this is our train yard finished. Yay. And, um, all of these were built of course, over here in, um, the train workshop area that I created so many episodes ago. Um, and then I was just waiting for stuff to craft, um, because they needed coins or whatever they needed, uh, different things. So, Anyway, as it is episode 100, I think I would like to place, and some, I think it was Yoki himself who said, you should place down one of the um, monument things for each type. Now, do I have any made? Oh, yes, I do. I've got the Cult of Nature one. I have the Cult of Science one. And what have we got here? This is the Cult of Prophet. Yes. Ha <laughs> ha. There we go. Where should we put these things? We could put them near our rail yard. Actually, that might be a really pretty spot for them shove them over here and I did actually trim some of the trees back and let some of them stay because I think the trees are quite pretty in this area all right I want to put these things down oh lovely look at this that is absolutely gorgeous wow is that pretty or what what does it do oh I can make nature signs green ultimate product uh or I can make wood it's a wood making machine. Yay. I don't know. I'll make green ultimate product. Don't even know what those are for. Let me see. What, what are they for? <laughs> green ultimate product. Green stuff. There we are. They are used in absolutely nothing. So yeah, that would not be, <laughs> not be terribly useful, but I could have used it to make nature signs. Let's see how many nature signs do we have in the world here? Nature signs. Why are they not showing it to me? Uh, disconnected chests. Where are these things? Oh, no. Oh, gosh. All right. That one. Yeah, that was expected. And request your chest. Oh, that's a bad problem. Ooh. I hope that area hasn't been getting attacked recently. Well, that's good to know. All right. Um, this is very strange. Are they here? Nature signs? No, no, no. That works. Search nature. 
Why are you not showing me stuff thing? Meow. All networks. Yep. Um, all right. I don't know why they're not. Does it show me like uh, coal? I know I should have coal. There's coal. So for whatever reason, it's not picking up the nature signs. That's unfortunate. We have traitor signs. We have 5 million traitor signs. <laughs> oh my God. How about science signs? Do we have any of those? We do. We have not very many. Oh, I know what I'm going to be making. All right, cool. Maybe I don't even have any nature signs. That could be. So let's make some. All right. We'll put those in a chest. Maybe, uh, let's put down the other, um, thingies. Whoa, that looks very impressive. Let's let us put down some beacons here. This top one goes Let's put two rows of beacons. And we'll shove down this science machine. Oh, that's very impressive. Oh my god, that looks cool. Hello, science machine. You look like that's a very funky little thing. What is it doing? Aha, it's scanning stuff. So maybe it's like a giant radar. <gasps> okay, I think it's a giant radar, guys. <laughs> this has now improved my worldview. This has made my worldview huge. Look at this. Oh my god. Wowie. Okay, that was unexpected. <laughs> and here are my smaller radars over there. Oh my god, I hope this doesn't lag the game. <laughs> now that I've discovered all these new chunks instantly. All right, Cult of Profit. You are going to give us stuff. What are you going to give us? Mm, okay, we'll put it there. Okay, you can make more trader signs. Yay! <laughs> For free. Um, you know what? I'm not going to have it make anything. It'll be okay. Now you, you are making science signs, so we're going to put you in a box. Uh, oh, it's a tiny little box too. Okay, we'll just shove this in there like this. There we go. Oh, they are being used. So maybe, you know what I bet they're being used for is probably to make more of these things. That's so funny. Um, nice. Well, those are the ultimate monuments that we can build. So that's really cool. These are really neat. Wow, this, this sector scanning is quite unexpected. I have never built one of those before. <laughs> so that's kind of funky. Um, and should I build a couple of more just for... Visual happiness sake. Yeah. Okay. That's better. Yep. Okay. An attack of OCD over. <laughs> oh, wow. All right. So that's cool. Um, yeah. Another thing that I was thinking about is, uh, you know what? I forgot that I have actually tons and tons and tons and tons of lubricant in my factory. I've got a bunch, like a bunch, a bunch. Uh, so I'm going to actually use that. Uh, to make Unicomp instead of relying on the oil situation that's down here. Actually, I, should, I could just go, go down there. Whoa, there's stuff being transferred here. Uh, but I want to go check on that first. Of course, I did check before we started the video. Uh, and it's doing quite well. Quite, quite well. Uh, a couple of you guys brought up the fact that I should be making more uh, lubricant. And yes, that's that's very uh, correct, I believe. I think it's right. Uh, so I've changed these to standard oil processing because it gives two more lubricant per recipe than the advanced. So I'm going to go with that. I think that's right. I'm not sure, but it might be. Um, we are making a ton of stuff. Uh, the oil has is at 2.2k, and we have full heavy oil, lots of light, well, some some light in petroleum, but look at all the Unicomp. I think, is it this one? 2.5k in storage. That is so funky. Yeah, we're clearly not producing, or, yeah, we, we're just not, oh, this is just totally full. Why is this not functioning? Oh, if you're greater than, you know, we're going to do greater than 2k. Because I don't think it can even shove itself in. Can't even put it in the uh, the tank. Because the pipes are just full. Crazy full. So anyway, yeah, we now have this stuff. Yay. Is this connected to the main network? I forgot. Let's see. Yes, it is. But what I could do is instead of putting this in this chest, I'm going to put it in a steel chest instead. And we're going to take it out. Uh, in fact, we're gonna do I'm gonna do something else. I'm gonna move this chest out here. Um, 
Okay, Q. Thank God for picker. Um, and I'm gonna get a belt going this way. I love these belts. They look so cool. They really do look awesomely cool. <sighs> Alright, that's just fine. Q to be picking. There we go. This goes away, that goes away. And you will put in stuff into the box. There we go. If the oil if the oil is high, where are you? There you are. Okay. If you're greater than, oops, no, no, no. Please, please work with me, thing. Two, one, two, three, two K. Set. Boom. And then you will take out of the box at your leisure. And in fact, I really should be a little bit more. I should be a bit more, um, uh, specific about this. This is a splitter. Good. I don't know if I like this splitter. That's it's kind of a tall looking thing. I don't know. Mm. Anyway, it should be fine. Boom. Oh, that looks so lovely. This is my new favorite belt type. I like this. I like the look of it. It is awesome. It has little green thingies walking up. 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 It is awesome. 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 I love it. Okay. So. We're going to cue this. Boom. Did I miss a square? I did. Okay, can we race this stuff? Yeah, we're going to race it. <gasps> yeah, that doesn't help. Alright, um, we're going to upgrade these trees. No more trees need upgrading. This looks looking okay. I just want to basically move this closer so that my, um, my ro robots don't have to suffer in carrying it quite so far. Oh my goodness, I'm out. No, I'm out of stuffs. All right, come on, give me more belt stuff, please. I need it. Robots, I really need it. Give, give, give. Here, give it here. But yeah, I'll take this up to the farming area, I think. Oh, here we go. Is it all filled up already? Probably is. Because we've got a ton 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 of stuff wow look at how fast it's zooming along on that belt it's so beautiful nice yeah I definitely need to, to get this going might even add another chest or something like that or aha there is another <laughs> there's another condition that I could do instead and not mess with this silliness. Um, <laughs> yeah, why didn't I think about that? I don't know. I don't know. We can do this instead. Basically a priority type splitter. It says, if oil, so why didn't I think about this? I don't know. I guess I kind of wanted a buffer system as well. Where is it? There it is. If oil greater than 2,000. Boom. Set. Then you can work. Yeah, this doesn't actually give us a buffer, but we can put a buffer at the end. That buffer at the end is okay. Soup, soup, soup. Here we are. Can I have more belt, please? Thing. I really need more belt. I want. Oh, there it is. Haha. -ha. Excellent. Shove this over. Hey world, how you doing? I brought stuff. Uh, right. Um, let me grab... Oh, this is... I don't know if I should... That's kind of a very inconvenient spot, isn't it? Um, put it this way. Like here. And basically shove this into a few provider chests. And this can take up all the slack we need, really. One, two, three, two, three. That should do it. Nice. Whoa. 
It's funny this, um, how this flows or doesn't flow. It looks very funky. But we also, we're probably going to need more of these guys anyway. Uh, because two is enough for a blue belt, but we're not dealing with blue belt. This is green funky awesome belt, which I adore. Yes, to the end of time. Okay, that'll do for now. How's this working? Okay, here we go. We got stuff functioning. Oh my god, I love seeing those little pink cubes go. Oh my god, conveyor belt love here. It's so awesome. So how's it going? How are we doing here? So basically this should allow us to have a backup of pink stuff if there's not enough oil going on. Uh, right now I think we're suffering under a glut of heavy oil. So we're going to need to build more of these guys. Um... Yeah, which I didn't really leave much room for expansion. That's not great, but it's okay. We can we can sort it. It is not a problem because we can do this. Can copy paste, copy paste. Go, kaboom, kaboom. This can go that way. You guys can have fun with this thing. La di da, la di da. Good. And that will work. Grab a few beacons. Well, just one. One is enough. Because one can turn into many. I should take these out. Do this way instead. Okay, so how's that flowing? Does that work better? 2.2 heavy oil. How's this going? Is this faster? Seems faster. Can we keep up? That's the real question. Okay, and here we are producing Unicomp like mad. Okay, this is definitely filling up. So we're going to need more of these guys. So basically, I should have built this so that it's more easily expandable with the belt. But uh, the reality is, oh, oh, and here we're, yeah, we're using more oil. So we're going to have to generate more oil before we can do much else. Wow, this pipe is just totally, totally full. Uh, I might even have to do a... You know what I can do? I can do this. I can um, build a thingy here. Is that right? Yeah, that's about right. Um, or down here. Let's do it down here. Get one of these like this. There we are. And have this just transfer directly into this. And then that will work better. Whoops. Picked the wrong thing. All right. And these guys, whoa, non-functioning things. Not so good. Mm. Let us put a power pole down here then. Works for me. All right, and now this one should... Okay, it's back running again. Excellent. That's what we want to see. All right, so we're producing masses and masses of Unicomp. This is good. It's great. And you should be given also speed modules. I don't know why I didn't uh, do some of these. Oh, I think I redid those. Maybe that's why. I don't know. But it doesn't really matter that much. We have little light oil. We've got a little petroleum. It is going up, though. Now that we have those extra refineries going, how are you doing? 2.0 heavy oil. So this is uh, functioning well, very, very nicely. Yep. We can afford to add maybe a couple more machines, I think. All right, good. Nice. Okay, so this is our perpetual <laughs> Unicomp machine. <laughs> And it's now, oh, look at this speed on this belt. This is a perfect travelator. If only we had these in Sim Airport, that would be nice. Anyway, um, but I have overlooked something, and Yuoki pointed this out to me, and thank you very much for that, because <laughs> I kind of forgot about it. I was like, okay. So the reason we've not been using oil is because we haven't needed it, because we have a ton of stuff. Let's see, how is this sulfuric acid doing? What we need to do is we have... We have lubricant right here. We have full lubricant, which we've been, um, yeah, <laughs> we've been making out of corn stuff. Um, 
but we haven't been using much of it because we've been building other things. So basically I'm going to turn this lubricant into a uh, unicomp. All right. So this, these pipes are so stupidly done over here. I don't like this at all. Is there much in these storage chests? It doesn't seem like it. No, I'm going to delete those. I don't want any of them here because there's not a lot of stuff in there anyway. Uh, and we're going to make a, um, a Unicomp processing center over here instead. So what do we need for this? We need pipes. We've got the pipes. We need a, a tank. Um, and this tank is connected to the entire system. So we'll be able to get a nice reading on this tank, which is good. I think we'll take this and make it just straight pipe here for now. Get the tank, fill it up with lube. And this is going to be our measuring device. Okay, let's get some of these trees out. And we're going to need some motor restructors for all this. Where are you? Simota, where are you? There you are. Good. Good, good, good. And, oh, oh no, 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 no. Base production. Nope, beacon speed two is what we want. Because I want to put a speed beacon thing here. Uh, and then we're going to put our Samoda Restructors above that. Uh, well. Oh, never mind. We're all good. Simota, hello. I think we can put it here. Okay. Lubricant into Unicomp. That's too close. Too darn close. Uh, let's get the pipe stretched first. Um... There we go, like this. This is what we need. We need to have a long pipe this way. I'm gonna have that pipe go that way. But how are we gonna control this? Hmm, that's the question. Do we put a pump here? Can we put like a small pump? Or, oh, ooh, no. See, the problem with the small pump is that it's extremely limited in throughput. But I could do a... We could do this, the structure for the pump. All right, we can do... I think the maximum needed is five uh, for that. So if we do this, one, two, three, four, five. Yeah. And this is like the maximum pump structure that you would ever need kind of thing. There we go. I don't know if it matters if I... Eh, I'll leave it. That should be fine, I think. Okay, and here's the pump going there. Okay, so that'll be fine, I think. So now these guys are only going to pump if the tank... Come on, connect all together. Now. Ooh, the tank is already full. Holy fuzzy cats. All right, if the tank has more than... I don't know, 2,000? Let's say 1,500, because we have another tank along the line. So this should be just fine for what we need. I don't know how many we need. Several, maybe. There we go. I really should have just, yeah. Okay, good. Now, now, the other thing we can do is, do we want to be very space efficient or do we care that much? I don't know. We could be, let's see, let's get our boxes out. Okay, one, two, three, right. It's going to be one, two. Okay, that should be fine. And we need, do need to put some productivity. Can we have, nope, we can't have productivity, but we can have speed. Speed for the wind. Why are these keeping on going? Holy fuzzy cats. They're producing a ton of stuff just without even unloading it. Well, we saw the other one hold, held 2.5 thousand Unicomp in the machine at once. That's quite a lot, uh, just slightly a lot. Okay, we'll do this. Boom, 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 boom. All right. 
And then we need our other ones. Okay, great. And these guys will be programmed for Unicomp. Okay, nice. We now have more things making Unicomp. And so this is going to use up all of the corn stuff, which is excellent because we actually have been having too much corn and I haven't had nothing to do with it. Uh, so this is great. This is actually really good. And I can actually add speed modules here too. I might have to change. Are these guys running short on hydraulic fluid at all? Hmm. Mm, doesn't seem like it. Seems like they're doing okay. But I can also, I'm, I also want to add some speed beacons here because they need it or they don't know they need it, but they probably do. Now this thing, oh, nature science. Hello, nature science. Get this moved here. There we go. I don't know what was possessing me. I, I did, for some reason, I have not added speed beacons to this area and that's like, why? Hello? This thing is doing okay. We're waiting for veggie oil. The veggie oil has been totally used up. This is just needing lots and lots of corn. And we're not requesting enough corn, clearly. So let's request like 300 corn. Is that the right one? Yeah, okay. Corn, corn. Shove, shove. All the corn in. Please, bots, go for it. There we go. Okay. What are you missing? You're missing hydraulic pressured fluid. Oh, and you're missing veggie oil too. Why are you not? Oh, because you're in the wrong direction. Aha, that would help. There we are. Okay, good. Oh, we're seeing a flurry of robot activity. How nice. Excellent. Okay, so now we have billions and billions of Unicomp. We are now waiting for lubricant. So lubricant is not being made fast enough because not enough veggie oil. But this is looking pretty darn good. These are just slow. So I think if I were to improve this, I would definitely add speed beacons. Um, all right. Well, we have done... Wow, I feel like we've done so much in this factory. And I think we've done pretty much everything, haven't we? Um, we haven't gotten all of these items, but we easily could. Um, Chitrotin. So, um, all right. The other thing that I noticed that I was lacking, uh, was I went down to the lower part of the factory where we're making, um, copper and steel and stuff. And I had to do some adjustment on, on the piping because we actually had way, way, way too much contaminated water. We were literally full on this. So I put a second pipe going this way just for throughput issues. Uh, I probably would need another one of these converters over there by the copper. Like for each of these things, not even bother having this huge thing because basically it's just limited by the pipes. I mean, this thing needs 48 contaminated fluid to work. Like the second machine isn't even working at all. So, um, yeah, that's kind of funky, I think. And I am using the biggest pipes all the way along to take the fluid there, but it's been kind of weird. So, but the good thing is, is we've, wait, what are we missing here? Huh? Oh, you're missing those things. Oh, that's not good. Somehow I ran out of things. That's not great. That is definitely not great. Do I have any more of those things? I might. I do. Yay. Hey there. Here, put these things out. Have fun. Why does this not have speed modules in it? I don't even know. How are you doing? You have plenty of water. I don't need to put speed modules there. Good, good, good. Um, so this may need just may just need to go faster. Um, ah, and the other thing is I could stand to put a tiny chest here for those uh, wrenches because maybe we just don't have enough wrenches. There we go. That's looking a little bit better, possibly, but. Uh, let's add, do we have any more wrenches? I need more wrenches. Thing, game. I need more wrenches. Give me wrenches. Oh, there they are. Okay. So I'll put them in the box. Wrench. Wrench box, wrench. 
Uh, where did those other things go? I'm sure I must be having those things delivered. Those, um, these thingies. There they are. Multifunctional tool heads. So multifunctional tool heads go where? Oh, I lost them again. No. Those are the plasma cannons. I know they must be here somewhere. Drat. I don't know where they are. Uh, right. Multi. Would help if I could spell it correctly. Would definitely help. So where are they? Ah, there they are. Okay. There we go. Click this, then click that, and that will release a few more into the world. That's nice. Okay, so that looks like a lot better. I think that's better. We needed more there. And this is having plenty of wrenches. Good, good, good. Do we have tons in this? I have too many. Okay, so that's basically the problem, is I had way too many here, and um, this basically just needs speed beacons around this little guy here, so it works faster. Yep, there we go. Now, how are you guys doing? You're converting pretty darn fast. I'm just limited by pipes. Okay. Okay. All right, so it is looking pretty good. Very, very good. I'm quite happy about this. The steel is a little bit lower because, I think it's just because of the, it takes a while for steel to get processed. We also aren't getting lots and lots of um, iron up here because it's being split off. So I might think about adding another of these uh, iron arrays to feed that steel better. Okay, so let's see what else we've got. Wow, look at all this Unicomp flowing in. Oh my god, we have so much. <laughs> That's nice. I forgot what we were even using Unicomp for, to be honest. <laughs> and I have several trader signs. These are not going at all. Why are these not functioning? Are they missing stuff? We just don't have the meat or whatever. These guys aren't functioning. Why not? Oh, too many fish. We've got too many of everything. We've got all the fish. What are you missing? Oh, no substrain. Oh, no. Surely we're making some, aren't we? You guys are making stuff. You're missing substrain seeds. No, you just have too much substrain. Now, oh, spliced cells. How nice. Am I, like, limiting the spliced cells or something? Now, wait a second. If you guys need substrain, oh, you have too much alien blood that you can't put out. That's your problem. Okay, let's see what's going on with that. Oh, golly gee. What do we do with that? Let's see. What do we do with that? You can make it DNA from life forms. All right. So we're going to start making more DNA, I guess. Is that, that's probably not that one. Nope. DNA. Okay, it's this one. Need raw meat and alien blood and stuff. Ooh. Cool. All right, so that's what we can do with that alien blood because that's clearly backed up now. Um, same thing with this. I bet these are, yeah, that's where that one's backed up and they're all backed up. Oh my gosh, this is kind of a disaster. So what are you needing? You need more DNA ohms. Why am I not getting any of that? Let's figure out why that one is not coming up. DNA ohm. Okay, is that this? Yeah, you're missing what? Veritins. Why do I not have Veritin? Because this other stuff shut down. Okay, because <laughs> Veritin comes from one of these critters, this one actually. Yeah, well, looks like we're going to have to use this to get other stuff, um, or that should be used to get other stuff. I feel, actually, I feel like... We've pretty much completed um, a, a lot of what there is to do in this mod. Um, and I feel like maybe episode 100 should be the end of the series because, as you can see, we have created an enormous sprawling factory that has been serving us well for all of these months. 
So I, I think, it's, yeah, I think maybe this should be the end episode. So I thank you everyone for joining me in this lovely journey. And I thank you, Yuoki, for making such an amazing, awesome mod. I've really, really enjoyed playing with it. It is going to be so hard to do um, vanilla in 0 0.15. I'm going to miss those robots and all the speed and stuff. Um, but yeah, this is a great mod. So guys, if you want a good mod to play, I really, really have enjoyed this one. It has so much stuff to offer and Yoki keeps on improving it all the time. So I have no doubt that all of these things will keep on... Um, he will keep on making changes for us and, and providing fun stuff to do. All right. Well, thank you again for joining me. Take care of yourselves and each other, and I'll see you in the next series. Bye.